love our kids here at Carver. We do. There is not one teacher or staff member on campus that doesn't treat those babies like our own. When you come into the classroom and it does look like that chaos, they learn through play. Everything is hands-on. If I can instill in them the courage and the confidence that they are little superheroes and that they can tackle it and they can do it even if it's hard, that they already have that mindset, I can. Be able to. It allowed for him to have structure. He has English or English, English reading. He has science, you know, he has PE. And so he's starting to get that structure. He's starting those building blocks basically of learning what he needs to do in order to be successful. Mucho su comportamiento, un niño más educado, su conocimiento ha sido ha ido progresando, ha aprendido mucho. Sí, un cambio total. At this age, they need time to play, they need time to interact, and then help build social skills. Out here, they got so much, they have so much time to play with each other and interact with each other, building relationships with each other. So our primary goal is to make sure that we're uh, setting kids up for success when they go to kindergarten. Bring your children to kindergarten. We're ready for them. We have fantastic teachers that work numerous hours to prepare for your child to come to kindergarten. When they walk in that first day, some kids have never held a pencil, have never been able um, to write their name. At the end of the year, they're holding that pencil, they're drawing those pictures, they're writing more than just a sentence. They're telling you a story. To see them just get excited and cheer each other on. And so I really encourage them to come to kindergarten to fill those individual needs and make sure that they, their foundation for their academics really sets a tone for their educational journey. It gives them the advantage to succeed. Why wouldn't you give them that advantage?